Did you see the one I'm using? Look where the camera is then. <laughs> That's not silver. Yeah, platinum heroic one for passing every level on heroic. Uh, invite player. Jining. What do you think of my new logo and stuff? And I'm guessing that you're now using... Yeah, you're using Rampant Cortana. Cortana is Cortana, and Rampant Cortana was Cortana when she was going rampant. She looks slightly maniacal-like when she's rampant. Because she looks kind of glitchy and evil. Proper rampant Cortana would be if she was red instead of blue. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Pick a game between... Okay, right. We can do a playlist from one of the Halos, or we could do a cross-game playlist. Keep in mind now that sometimes changing game engine crashes the game. Which one? Pick a halo between one and four. Do you want to like go through the first one first or? Alright. We could just try the playlist of the legendary campaign. We could just try the legendary campaign one if you want. Because there's no co-op. There's no co-op campaign for Halo 1 other than the easy normal heroic or legendary. You know, I'm not even going to turn on the scoring in time heads up multiple. Uh, display there now. I used to, I kind of find it distracting thinking about it like. So you'd be looking and you'd be like, oh my god, we're gonna make it! And then we just fuck up. So, if you don't mind me asking, what was so shitty about today? Hey, Andrews, man, how are we doing? You're never going to leave that 420 shit alone area. <laughs> how are things, anyway? <coughs> I had to have a haircut and shave, man. Fucking... It's my 26th this Saturday, but it's also my daughter's uh, christening. So, I have to kind of look my best. And I couldn't look my best now if I looked like a fucking... a Wookiee now, could I? Tired? Fair enough, dude. Uh, yeah, Andrew's a tired. He's very tired. Yeah, tired. Why would you punch him in the dick? You'd punch him in the dick because he's tired? <laughs> I suppose that is a good way of waking someone up. <laughs> yeah, and this is the original Halo. I forgot about it. I'll see about not picking up a health pack as well.
there's no skulls. It's legendary, but there's no skulls on it. I was half tempted to turn on the, the melee skulls. Work to win, I guess. At least you have a job, dude. That's that's my answer to that. Like, at least you have a job. I fucking wish I could bitch about a job. Not even joking. I really wish I could. Hopefully, anyway, after tomorrow morning, actually. Um, tomorrow morning I have a meeting. Jesus Christ, I have two meetings tomorrow. I have to go to. I have one about possibility of going into courses to advance my experiences in the IT industry. So that I can finally have it down as officially three years in the IT industry. So then that I could like get jobs because I have all the qualifications, I have everything like that, but I can't get a job until I have the time in, you know, quote unquote. And um, if there's this new government scheme that's not even that isn't run by the government uh, after com being introduced over here, that hopefully. There's 300 places in Ireland, and hopefully I can get one of them. And uh, that's just sort me out for work, like by by maybe in six months' time. Will you run in there and teleport me up there? Because I have a feeling if I run up there, that I'll end up c collecting that health pack. Oh, you are IT certified, you lucky son of a gun. I was in um, Jobsbridge scheme this year, well, this year and last year, and I'm uh, I'm basically a fully certified V architect, um, EMC proven professional. What do you call it again, Kelly? EMC proven professional, uh, CompTIA certified network administrator, and what's the other one? It's the VMware one. Um, a VCP, a VMware Certified Professional. To, to work with... Um, no, not the VBlox, okay, that was VC, not VMware. To work with... Um, virtual Machines, Cloud and the like. But I have all those certificates and shit, and I'm able to prove that I've put in the time, the effort, and I know what I'm doing when someone faces me off with a fucking virtual um, data center block that I know what to do physically and with the, th the hardware and the software. Um, but it's just the fact that I don't have the years in the IT industry. Because it's shorter than Melamphy. Ever, everyone calls me Mel, Mela, Melam. Why? I don't mind the least. Apparently, it annoys Kelly when people call me Mela. <laughs> David currently logging into Twitch just to spam it now. He, he literally just goes, hey, hey, she shouldn't have said that. <laughs> Make a VR game where you can have Sword Air Online in real life, not that Oculus Rift. Well, actually, Andres, that would be software development and software hardware engineering, which. I don't have hardware engineering, but I do have a software development certification as well. I've, I actually made my own once be millionaire uh, game before. I'm trying to find a way that I can actually put it up online in some way where um, I could like give people the link and they can go and check it out if they want. But 
I can't just throw it up on some random slate, like, I can't ask for it to be added to, like, New Grounds or Albino Black Sheep or anything like that, because there's a lot of copyright issues, because there's all the sound effects and the music from the TV show and the music and stuff like that from the Once Be Millionaire Chris Tarrant TV show, do you know what I mean? And there's, uh, I have a coded in with the stuff where when you answer a question, um, the further you are up the money, the longer it takes for you to be told if you're right or wrong and all that sort of shit. I'll actually have to email you, um, the, uh, binary files for that, actually, Dave. You can see it. Was I telling you about that before? Fair enough. That was my end of your project when I was doing software development two years ago. I'm done. Ah, uh, well, I made the questions, man. I... There's 15 questions, it's the, it's literally the ex I even quoted in, uh, ask the audience 50-50 and phone a friend. It was a lot easier to code than you would think, you just need to kind of think outside the box. It was like, um, for the 50-50 one, it's like, it's like, if the answer is A, take away B and C, if the answer is B, take away A and D, if the answer is C, take away A and B, do you know? It's only a little bit of code like that, there's no random, there's no RNG in it, but it seems like it has the presence of RNG, do you know what I mean? And, um, Ask the Audience was, it brings up that little, that little interface where it's like, oh, this is how many percentage said it's this, 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 or this, but I literally just have little PNG images of, like, if the answer is A, that has 80%. If the answer is B, that has 92%. Do you know? All that sort of shit, like. And uh, the phone a friend one was where um, it just comes up in text saying, do you know, oh, this is what your friend guessed it as. Do you know? I was going to put in sound bites, but I ran out of time and I had to submit it for the project. And I was planning on working more on it, but then I went into the jobs bridge thing. Um, since I have the time, no, actually, I might do it. I'm done as well, literally that second. But um, now that I have the time, I might go back to it and rework it. Because if even if I added it, like, it pulls the questions in off a database sheet, right? And all I need to do to add more questions to it, and, like, if I want to make it random, is put in more tables in the database and then have it where when you click start like don't you click play cool i'll run back but all i have to do is set it that when you click play that um there we go um that it would pick a random number between let's say if there was 10 different quizzes that it would pick a random number between 1 and 10 and then whichever number it gives you, it'll pick that table in the database. Do you know what I mean? I'm done. Back. Just need to collect some weapons. There we go. And some nades. But yeah, I'll see if there's a way that I can fucking even host it online, to just even just for 40 minutes, so that you can fucking take a go at it. But there's only one table in it at the moment, and the questions are actually based on um, it's the questions from the first time someone won the million on the American show. It's it's his set of questions, like. Oh my god, I'm lucky that I didn't have damage on me there. I ran straight into that fucking health pack. Okay, I'm gonna try my old trick here. Okay, I'm up as far as here. 
Do you want to try to make a run for it to get to as far as here? And if you die, you'll spawn by me. All your shields be down the whole way up. Just keep jumping. dead all right if you have uh, plasma pistol there just try to take some of them out did that oh did I get them with the thing job okay I need to pick up a new plasma pistol no, that's a plasma rifle. There's usually an elite right here, two of them. Yeah, it's only the end of the corridor. Shit. Sticky one of them. Both of them are down. I'm going to stay on this side now because there's a health kit on the floor there. And there's a health kit on the floor there. And there should be three grunts. It's scary that I fucking remember, like. We have to use the ship's maintenance access ways. Follow the nav point, it will lead you to an opening. Oh wait, Andres, if you're still there, do you mean... Like you're saying where it's sword art in real life. Do you mean in the way that like... Where you could stand in front of your TV and have something where you'd actually be doing the motions yourself? Because if if you're talking about that, then that shit has already been created, dude. It might not be very pristine and fucking flow perfectly, but people are working on that. Yo, there's a lot of free games on um on the 360. All right, there's a lot of games on the 360 that you can get in the arcade um to use with the Kinect that emulate like Fruit Ninja you know, and stuff like that. Yeah I know they sound they probably sound like shitty kids games but still you know that's the start of it. Give it a few years and they might be fucking perfect like like look at Guitar Hero. Do you know what I mean? When that first came out everyone thought it was a load of shit that you know it didn't work and all that crap. Now that it's gone, everyone wants it back. Do you know what I mean? I know you're better off running through here. Keep going, keep going, keep going, I'm getting hit. Yeah, no, no bad, no bad. Wait no, I spotted something here the last day. Move a small bit there. It was one of the directions I went inside these tunnels. <coughs> and we ended up at the end at the exit. Do you know what I mean? That way anyway, it's not 
part euh... No, but that's my point. If we go down that way and go through, um, you're trying to heat as well, Kelly. It's fucking freezing. Okay, I'm back. If we go down this way, right? And we go in here. Dave was insane, he probably won't be on for too long, so. You know, it's not like I'm going to be streaming all night, do you know what I Achievement. Achievement. <laughs> Over shields are for sissies. We're coming in too fast. Damn, airbrake failure. They blew too early. I'm losing her. Right, Maria. Chief, Chief, can you hear me? I'm just trying to think there now. Last, are you all right? Can you move? Yeah, in this level, don't jump. All right. There's nothing we can do. Warning. I detected multiple There's an achievement to pass a level without jumping. If we're lucky, the covenant will believe that everyone aboard this lifeboat died in a crash. So if you can help it, try not to. Inbound. They must be looking for survivors. I recommend immediate evasion. We'll try to be dodgy bastard to know about this. Obviously you were able to do that because I was fucking distracting them. No, we're gonna have to pick them off. That, that's what I was thinking, like. I'm reading a lifeboat beacon over the next hill. We should check to see if there are any survivors. And I was thinking if you want to fucking be careful about it, and I'll just try running rape, and if I die, I can spawn again. Do you know what I mean? To be honest with you, I think that's, like, the strategy to fucking goddess Halo 4 on Legendary, like. Especially with those fucking elites. It's a mess, sir. We're scattered all over the town. Heads up! I got a coveted dropship heading in. Over here! Do you know what? Let's get that whole thing of uh, passing this level without a warhog as well. Two words, one stone, luck. 
Yeah. We're Echo 419, or we're fucking full hammer. We usually come along, like. I'm down. I'm back. That lead took me down. But, um, do you know what I was saying to you in the message earlier there as well? Do you, did you say you were thinking that you were probably going to go for that EA access thing or what? I'm down. Oh, would you go? Oh, would you go for the yearly one? Yeah. Let's find him. Oh no, but I mean, but I mean, as a, as suppose as opposed to just getting a month of it for now. Because it's it's like three euro for a month. Yeah. Well, it can't run out that night. Yeah. You know why, don't you? The fucking drunken stream. Are you going to be joining me for that? It'll be a Saturday night, like. As long as that's okay with Trish, like. Jesus Christ. You were right about the fucking plasma pistol. I'm down. Thank you. No, but like, it takes longer to kill him with a fucking assault rifle, and I was only single bursting it there, like. The last two dropships here now. Wow. You jump. Kelly. Oh, if, oh, you wouldn't, like. But, um, are you grabbing edge as well? Cool. Bollocks. I'm done. my white ones. Better than that, though. Okay, the red guy is down.
See, I can't use my normal fucking dodging techniques. You jump around them like, you know what I mean? Like a fucking spider monkey. And close that door as well. You turn on the heat, didn't you? Alright, so, talk to you in a small way. Look, more lifeboats. They're coming in fast. If those lifeboats make it down, the Covenant are going to be right on top of them. Fellhammer, we need you to disengage your warthog. The Master Chief and I are going to see if we can save some soldiers. Roger, Cortana. Okay, Charlie. Oh, Chief, you're a bastard. Saddle up and give them hell. I was about to jump over you there. Imagine that as a challenge, the complete Master Chief saga without jumping. We need that warthog if we want to get to the other lifeboats in time. There's some levels you have to. I suppose if you think about it, you wouldn't, because, rel like realistically, there's always ramps. Oh my God, we can't do it. We have to pick the warhog or the jumping. Fuck it, let's let's jump over the ramp. Because since we're already this far running down, we can do the no jumping in some other level. We can't do the no warhog in a different level. Ah, oh, but you could even do that on fucking easy difficulty on Pillar of Autumn or something, do you know what I mean? I don't think it has to be hit, uh, Heroic or Legendary. No, oh, is there a way across here without jumping? Because I don't think we can actually get across... Wait, wait, don't jump. We can't make that jump. So there is a way across, like. Think about it, like. They wouldn't put that achievement in unless you could do it. And... fuck you doing? <laughs> yeah. What do you think? But it looks like that's too far to jump. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, man, that's definitely too far to jump.
Do you know what I mean? Some other time. Oh fuck it, yeah, I have no grenades. Anything? Did you jump? Of course, that will be the checkpoint then. Give me one second. Do you know what? You try to do. You have a need, don't you? If you want to try that, why I go and get the Warhog? And if you get across, you get across. If you don't, we'll just take the Warhog. But yeah, I did that one level earlier in Halo 2, and um, about fucking 13 achievements popped. Just one after another, like. So there was beating that level, beating that level in pair time, beating Halo 2 on easy, beating Halo 2 on normal, beating Halo 2 on hard. Beating all campaigns on easy, beating all campaigns on normal, beating all campaigns on le on fucking heroic, you know. Any luck? Fuck it, I'm on the way. <laughs> the music wouldn't turn on until we got into the warhog. is not a natural formation. Someone built it, so it must lead somewhere. I've hacked into the Covenant Battle Network. We're actually broadcasting tactical data on unencrypted channels. We should show them who they're dealing with. Master Chief, I'm going to use your suit's transcom system to monitor their chatter. Already know, like, Why'd, why'd you get out? Yeah, it's legendary, dude. You dead? Yeah, you're dead. Back up, back up. Use the turret, like. Yep. There's two on her rock. Jackal on the left.
There's the other boys up there as well. Though. Look, I'll leave you there, alright? There we go. You got teleported to me anyway. Because if you didn't, the cutscene wouldn't have played like. sake it's all bullshit like at this stage I literally have my thumb glued to the right stick like like it nearly hurts not to press A yeah Oh yeah, um, I was thinking as well of uh, maybe a PS4 as well. Thinking of it. There's new traffic on the Covenant battle. Because it's, it's just like fair enough. I, the way I'm looking at it the is really the Wii U against the PS4, right? And with the Wii U, fair enough, there's the Wind Waker HD, there's the new Super Smash, there's all that stuff, right? But then with PS4, you're able to stream with it. There's Surgeon Simulator, there's the new Abe's Odyssey, there's fucking Binding of Isaac Rebirth. You know... It's just like me and Kelly are both dying to play that new Abe's Odyssey. But that's only ever going to be on the PS4. It's never going to be on anything else. Not that I can think of. Well, I suppose maybe. Um, what's the PlayStation version of Mass Effect again? Killzone. There's a new kill zone, I think. Survivors detected. Marines are concealed in those rocks. And then they'd say they say that, you know, destiny is supposed to be better and all that shit. No, apparently on the PS4 it's 60 FPS, whereas on the Xbox One it isn't apparently, so. Hey Dutchie, how we doing dude? Hey DJ. That's another one, Bloodborne. That's another one that's only on PS4. Is that a multiplayer game though? Not sure. No, because that's the thing, me and uh me and Kyle were talking about um you know where he'd be helping me out with a computer like and we kind of agreed on a price and stuff like that, so, like, I'm going to be able to save up to see towards getting another console, and I was thinking, if I get, if, like, if he's going to be giving me that, that PC, that'll be in January, but what if I get a PS4 in the meantime, because if I get a Wii U, I can't stream from that until January, do you know what I mean? On Bloodborne is multiplayer, kind of like Demon Souls, apparently. 
But is that really multiplayer? Like, isn't that the whole thing where you're playing away in the campaign and you see other players and they can, like, invade your game or some shit like that? Or is that Dark Souls? I might be thinking of Dark Souls. Fuck you not being able to jump. <laughs> and for those of you who have just joined, we are trying to get the achievement for no jumping. We were trying to do the no jumping and no using the Warhog in this level, but since we can't jump, we can't nade jump. So, that part where you need to do that little jump with the Warhog, you need to do a nade jump if you're not going to use the Warhog. You're being raped from above, dude. Remember, you can't take out the turret in this one. Man, I kept going down. Yeah, it's uh, it's Dave that's Dave Devlin that's uh, playing multiplayer with me. Doing, we got uh, Legendary Halo 4 done, and now we're doing Legendary Halo 1. No bother, dude. Yeah, no bother. Hey, man. The surgery went fucking perfect, dude. Nice one for asking. Um, everything went perfect. There was no complications. There was no fuck-ups. She was in at 8 o'clock that morning. She was home at 5 o'clock that evening. She's recovering grand. She's able to eat properly again. She's feeling better about herself. You know. So it all went the way we wanted it to. Did you enjoy that? No, did you? Ooh, Jesus, he didn't. I'm sorry, but I had to kill your brother, like. Uh, that's that dropship. Here's this one. Oh Jesus, three reds. Tag one of them. One of them's down anyway. And so am um, I. There we go. You don't have to sticky my kneecap. I'm down, man. Yeah, cool. Okay, there's another one over here. Okay, I took down the uh, Elite, but the rest of them took me down. You're being hit from both sides by dropships. They were going back. Ah, no! 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 Fucking plasma pistol overheated. No. Nope. 
Yeah, they all ran over this way. There we go. Do you want to quickly just drive the car over her? Actually, never mind. It's grand. I'll be there in two seconds. Alright, Joe Cortana. On my way. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Am I going the wrong way? I have a very overbearing feeling I'm going the wrong way. Ah, uh, you'd need one or two of the ones at the very start. See, this is the shit that I hate. I just came back into the place we just left. No, but see what I mean? I, I just had a feeling I was going the wrong way. Then I ended up fucking doing a 180 by mistake. Because as soon as you come over this canyon, then it's supposed to be straight across from you. Yeah, there it is. What, how, what are you doing? Why didn't I see that no a second ago? That happens now and again for some reason. But no. No, it's the other side. I'm over the warhog. I'll call in a drop ship to pick them up. I'm done. Just did the second, yeah. The second you were saying it. Shit. Red guy down. Well, here's one. Don't. I'm down. I'm back. So have you been anyway, Dutchy man? I'm down. Shit. Nah, move, man, move. You're done. Yeah, your man had a clear shot in it with the needler the whole way, like. I'm down. Okay. Here's what we'll do. I'm 
and don't. Too many enemies nearby. Back. I'm down. Back. Sure, do you want uh, to mine if you want to drive, look. This last one was all we do we did last time. If you want to stay up top and take out the guys up there, and I'll take down the guys inside. Located and secured the Pillar of Autumn's crash site. The good news is Captain is still alive. The bad news is the Covenant has captured the entire surviving man crew. Let's hurry and find the final lifeboat so we can link up with the rest of the survivors. Maybe they took cover in that structure and shut down. That's the inside cleared up. So now we just have to clear out the rest of them. Oh shit!
all boats go down. There we go, I'm down. Run over to that peak. There we go. I've never had that happen where all of them died. I found Captain Keys. He's being held on a Covenant cruiser, the Truth and Reconciliation, a ship I disabled before we abandoned the Autumn. The Truth and Reconciliation touched down on a desert plateau, roughly 300 kilometers from the Feet firmly planted. The enemy has Did you get her? Captain Keys and are holding him aboard one of their cruisers. The oh, cool. Reconciliation. The ship is currently holding position approximately 300 meters above the other. You trade that. Yeah, you trade the grenade. <laughs> Uh, there might be a counter now or something. Like it might be because that level has like six different sections. You can jump at least three times or some shit like that. That's the end of it for you anyway for tonight, is it? Cool. No problem, dude. Ah, nice. And we can get... Yeah. But that's the thing, over the next couple of days, now we'll get all of them done. And whatever ones we're missing, uh, we'll attempt on Saturday. Uh, but if we have it done by Saturday, we'll just do the, as much of the Master Chief sag as we can while drinking. Oh. Yeah. Fuck it, sure. Um, if all comes on, anyway, I'll talk to you there tomorrow, sure. I'll probably be home at about 2 o'clock. Yeah, cool. Sure, I'll talk to you then. Good luck. Alright lads, that's me for tonight. I wasn't even planning on uh, coming on tonight. I thought I'd be more busy. But um, I'm just glad I got that much done. Like, uh, So, thanks for joining us again lads. Saw a couple of faces around tonight I haven't seen in a while. Great to see you, like. And um, it's this Saturday that we'll be doing a drunken stream Saturday night. For my 26th birthday. So. I will talk to you. Uh, next time lads. And uh, good luck.